everyone, my name is Sandra. Welcome back to my channel. This is the week of planning from July 5th to the 11th. I'm going to start in my Erin Condren and we will do the bullet journal after. So I've decided to change the um, color scheme. So this was last week and I'm in love. Well, I guess this week because I'm filming on a Thursday. I love this setup. I think it's so cute, but I'm going to completely change the colors and um, we're just going to get started. Trigger and I'm just blown away downright. My mind's indifferent, know what's wrong or right. Her bite is bittersweet, cause I'm stuck between her lines. She silenced me with words that shouldn't be combined. Okay, so we're all done the plan with me. It's pretty basic this week because I honestly don't have a lot going on. There's no appointments or anything like that. So Sunday, and actually basically I won't talk about the filming or editing. Um, I'm basically posting videos on Sunday, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So I have like a dedicated schedule that I'm trying to be dedicated to. I'm trying to stick to it because it's really hard. There's a lot of times I don't get the video filmed and then or edited for that matter and then I can't post that particular video and I have to switch it to a different one. So I'm really trying to stay on schedule. That's one of my goals for the kind of like the three quarter period. I'm going to try to film a video every day this week. So going forward, so Sunday 
we are going to start the floor installation and I will water the plants, of course doing laundry and then try to fit in a movie night um, after we're done with the floor. Monday, grocery shopping, I'll probably grab a coffee. I want to book a couple of things for like later on. So I need to book Danny's three month checkup. That will be probably the first week of August. And also I want to have a date night on Saturday. So I'm gonna try to see if my mom is available on Saturday to babysit. And then we are going to uh, try to reserve because in order to get in, you have to have a reservation. You can't just walk in. Tuesday, we need I need to clean the washrooms. I need to do more laundry, water plants. This is just a beautiful decoration sticker here. Wednesday, we'll do the floors, water plants. So like I said, pretty pretty uh, mundane, not really a whole lot going on. Thursday, I'll be filming my plan with me. So again, filming something every day it might be a makeup tutorial, might be something in the office. I don't quite know, but Thursday will be a plan with me for sure. I have to pay the bills on Thursday, water the plants. It's also trash day for Friday and again, laundry. And if it's nice out, I don't know what the weather is right now, but if it is nice, I want to barbecue hamburgers. And then Friday, I need to fertilize plants. So usually I'll do that Friday or Saturday, but Saturday, Saturday works too if it's nice. So another decoration sticker. And then Saturday, just relax, try to have a date night in the afternoon. It won't be like a date night. It'll be more like a patio in the afternoon type thing. So spend some time with family, water the plants, and of course more laundry. And that is it for this week's plan with me. So I noticed, like, I wasn't sure if these colors would go together, but actually it's okay. I don't mind this kind of color scheme. And I like how that I've been breaking it up. It looks, it looks nice this way. So, and next week I'm going to do something different once again. So now let's get started on the bullet journal. That is it for my weekly spread in my 
bullet journal here. This one, now it's di quite different from the previous spread. If you want to check that, that out, I'm going to link my July bullet journal setup and you can watch the whole production. Um, this one is basically combined. So as I did before, like a double page spread was just my weekly dashboard. So I had my groceries, tasks, next week, events and meals on like a double page spread. And then on another double page spread was all of my stuff to do with YouTube. So I really had lots of room and to spread it out. But I found that this week I didn't need all that room and it was kind of a waste of paper. So I decided to combine it and I'm wondering if this is going to work. I usually require a lot of room for groceries more so than tasks. So this room might be enough. This up here is a little squishy, but I'm going to see how I can do this week. And if this is enough room, I might continue a format similar to this going forward. We'll see how it goes, I guess. And uh, that is it for this week. So I hope you guys like the change in layout and maybe it'll inspire you to change your own if you have a bullet journal as well. So if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, if you're new here, I would love if you subscribed and thank you to all my subscribers that I currently have right now. I appreciate you guys so, so much and be sure to tune in next time I post a video. I will have another plan with me going up next Sunday on the... I believe it is the 12th yes the 12th of July and also click that bell button so you'll be notified the next time I post a video also I just wanted to let you guys know um, I showed these in a stationary haul but I did end up adding the colored um, Erin Condren tabs to my bullet journal and I like that like it just kind of coincided to be a very similar color for July so I thought that was kind of neat, but I also have the black ones too. If you're curious, check out that haul. I'll link it for you at the end of the video. Okay, we'll talk to you guys soon. Bye now.